What's up guys, Shiny Zack here, back with another TCG pack opening video, and today I have something really awesome for you. I don't open up cards like this very often, but I decided since this is a really cool opportunity that I wanted to go ahead and get it done. I have here a booster box of the newest set, uh, Rising Fist. This is in Japanese, obviously. This will be coming out in English in August. And I really wanted to open this up because it just has some great artwork, some great cards, and I really want to get some cool stuff out of this box. So I've only opened up two other Japanese sets. I opened two boxes of Radiant Collection, which is more like a subset. I actually have that completed. And then I opened up a box of Wild Blaze and got an excellent, excellent, excellent pull out of that. So if you haven't seen that video, please go watch it. And hopefully this box will be just as good, as, if not better, than that one. So let's go ahead and open this up. I have my scissors here. Trusty red scissors as always to open these kinds of things up. There we go, wrapping's off. I'll probably save those if I want to cut the uh, the packs open. So there's the front of it as you, uh, as you saw before. So look at this cool artwork on the side. That's an awesome Mag Mortar artwork. You can see Electivire in the background there. There's a nice Dedenne artwork, very realistic. Uh, we have a cool Tornadus artwork there, and then Glaceon also on the side. And then there's the set name Rising Fist, and this random stuff on the back. So, let's open this up without trying to damage anything, if I can do that. Um, these are kind of difficult to get open sometimes. There we go. You can see on the bottom here, there's uh, what the pack art looks like on these little flaps, and then there is M Mega Lucario on that side, and then will, will there be something else on the other side? Nope, it's just uh, Mega Lucario, but that's cool. Let's pop this open back here as carefully as I can. There we go. And awesome. So that's what it looks like opened up. I'll be doing this in two parts just because I have the one box and I think 10 packs uh, per part is plenty. So let's go ahead and get 10 packs out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Boy, I'm bad at counting. Eight, nine, 10. All right, there we go. So we will uh, prop those up or something. Keep that to the side. Let's also get a DS if I can find one. There we go. Pop that down and We'll move the camera down. Now let's go ahead and open some Rising Fist XY number three, as you can see up there. And I'll open them from the bottom. The card trick, as always, should be one from the back. It should be the fourth card out of five. If you're interested, that's what the back of the uh, card looks like, or the pack looks like. All right. So this is what the little insert looks like. There may be multiple inserts, but that's one of them, anyway. And we have Shroomish, very cool. Clefable, I like that artwork. Noibat, very nice. And that Tornadus we saw in the box, which I guess will be a rare in our set. And my rare is a Stadium. Oh, I really should have pulled up the names of what these cards are. Let me be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. This card is called Fighting Stadium, and it says the attacks of each player's active fighting Pokemon do 20 more damage to active Pokemon EX before weakness and resistance. So that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get our second pack opened up here. There usually isn't something in the first pack of Japanese booster boxes. It's maybe like a 10% chance or maybe even less than that, so I'm not worried about that at all. Open this up here. Yep, there is another insert. This is what it looks like. There's Diancy right there. It may be talking about the movie or possibly a Diancy um, distribution of some kind. I'm not sure. We have Machoke. Kind of weird artwork there. And Amora, which may play a big part in this set. Torchic and Karina, an incredibly good trainer or trainer supporter card. I like this a lot. Can't wait to get it in English. And my rare is a Victory Bell Hollow. That is very, very cool looking. Oh man. Uh, let me get a sleeve for that. I have some sleeves. And I really like the Japanese hollow pattern that it has uh, all around the card instead of just on the artwork. But very nice Victory Bell Hollow. I'll put that to the side. And let's go ahead and open up another pack. There 
go. Alright, uh, that one also is different, I believe. So, that one has a Veltal on it, there's a Mega Charizard, some kind of machine, I'm not sure what that does. Uh, but here we go with the card trick. We have Electabuzz, very cool artwork on that. Scraggy, a Bellsprout, and this person is the Battle Reporter, I believe, yep. Battle Reporter, and my rare is that awesome Electivire that we could kind of see on the box. There's also a Slacking right there, very cool. Hopefully this will be a nice rare in our set. Just some awesome, awesome, awesome artwork. Oops. Part of why I decided to get this set actually is because of the amazing artwork. Can't wait to see it in English. Alright. Actually, Battle Reporter, which I was talking about earlier, has a full art form that I could get in this box. We have a Makuhita, Golet, not bad. Vigoroth, that kind of looks derpy, and a Thunderous. It looks like it's lifting a car. It is lifting a car, wow. And my rare? Oh, nice! First EX of the box is a very cool Heracross EX. Heracross in this set gets not only an EX, but a Mega EX. And its attack name, I believe, uh, its Mega Evolution's attack name in Japanese is Big Bang Horn. But this has some interesting attacks. Guard press for 40 for 2 energy. During your opponent's next turn, any damage done to this Pokemon is reduced by 20. Uh, and then Giga Power 80 uh, for 3, and you can do 40 more damage. If you do, then you do 20 to yourself. So let's put that in the background. Very nice pull. Uh, let's keep this box going and hope to get some more awesome EX pulls. Alright, another one of those machine leaflets. And we have a Pancham, Magmar, cool, Drowsy, and an Aurorus, very nice. And my rare is the one of the other stadiums, which I believe is called uh, something Mountain? It's uh, Mountain Ring, there you go. And what Mountain Ring does is, if the page will load, uh, each player's benched Pokemon received no damage from attacks. So it's like a Mr. Mime, uh, the one from Plasma Freeze in uh, stadium form. Pretty darn cool. I actually like that fairly well. Cards like Kiram and Landorus are seeing some play, but they're not widespread. So I don't know how that will work out with the new cards in this set. So we have a Licky Licky, interesting. Didn't know that was in this set. A uh, Hitmonchan with some cool artwork. A Poliwhirl. And an Electivire, another one of those. And my rare is, ooh, a Sylveon Hollow. Finally we get a nice one of these in the actual TCG set and not just in a, in a box. Very nice, 90 HP, Evolution. Nice to have a cool Fairy type Hollow with some really nice artwork in the background. I really like that a ton. So that's our second hollow of the box, not including Heracross CX. I will definitely take it. Alright, next pack here. Let's see if we can get another ultra rare pull uh, before we end this part off. We have Shelmet. I guess the Selgore is making another return. Clefairy. Poliwag, that's cute. And Flygon, very cool. They're adding in a lot of these artworks with uh, other Pokemon in the background. There's a, a Hariyama right there. And my rare is one of the new Fighting Energies. This is probably going to be uh, an, a very, very interesting game-changing card because it lets Fighting Pokemon do 20 more damage. And that is crucial. That is just crucial. So, that's a big deal. It's called Strong Energy. And it does 20 more to your opponent's active Pokemon. So, uh, all that for just one energy. Not really a drawback other than it has to be a fighting Pokemon. That's pretty big. Alright, next up we have a Mianfu, Weepin Bell, Eevee with an ability. I'd like to know what that does, so I'll look at that. And what is this? A Tool Strip. So, Tool Strip, before I get to that Eevee. Return up to two Pokemon tool cards attached to your Pokemon to your hand, which I have no idea why you'd run that. Um, 
absolutely no idea why they'd print that. Its ability, Eevee's ability says, whenever you attach a basic energy card from your hand to this Pokemon, you may search your deck for a card that evolves from this Pokemon, like Sylveon, that is the same type as the energy card you attach to this Pokemon. Interesting. And then shuffle your deck. And my rare... Oh, wow! Very nice! Mega Lucario. EX. Awesome! I was kind of hoping to pull this one, just because it is the feature of the set. Mega Lucario, very nice. Rising Fist is the attack name, and this has some very, very nice artwork. I am a big fan of this, so very awesome to pull this. Maybe I can pull a Lucario EX to go with it. Its attack does 140, and then you discard an energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon, so not a bad attack at all. And we have two more packs for this part, so let's go ahead and open this up. See if we can get another hollow or another ultra rare, even. We should be getting at least one because I think we'll get an average of five per part, and we have four, two hollows, and two EXs. Very nice Clauncher. Clauncher was one of my favorite Pokemons when they introduced X and Y. Scrafty, Gothita, and some nice Hariyama artwork. And my rare is a hollow Blaziken. Excellent! That has some awesome artwork to it. Uh, I can't wait for them to put in Mega Blaziken EX into the uh, format sometime, as well as a Blaziken EX. I'm sure they're going to do that closer to when they have Sceptile EX and Mega and then Swampert EX and the Mega. So that's pretty cool. 140 HP is pretty nice. And another really cool Hollow. So last pack of the part, and then I will see you guys in part two. It's not often that I do Japanese openings, so I hope you guys are enjoying this. If you are, uh, I'd appreciate it if you left a like or a comment or something, or both. That'd be great. But this is the last pack for this part. We have a Machop, Klefki, Hitmonlee, and the other kind of special energy, which is a Grass Energy. Very nice. The actual name of it is Herb Energy. And you can only attach it to grass Pokemon when you play it from your hand. Heal 30 damage from the grass Pokemon you attach it to. And then my rare is a Golurk. Very cool looking, actually. I'm a big fan of that. So that is it for part one. We got three hollows in this part. We have a Blaziken, a Sylveon, and a Weeping Bell. And then we got two EXs here. Uh, if I can get them from the background. We have... Uh, a Mega Lucario EX and a Heracross EX. So that's a great start to this box. That is going to do it for me. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Like and favorite the video and leave a comment below. And until next time, I will see you guys later.